Hi guys, so today is another common question of the day. Um, I'd like to do at least one of these a day if I can, but today's is about um, kind of like a, I don't know. <laughs> I always get lost when I record videos, but anyways, uh, I'll just read you the short story about this one. My girlfriend and I have been together a bit over seven months, and she's been very quiet, but when she does talk to me, she's very rude and calls me names and just goes over off over stupid things. She whines and has an attitude. I just simply do not know what to do. I do love her a lot, but I can't deal with the Wicked Witch anymore. Um, a lot of people experience this in relationships. Maybe not exactly that. Um, but I do know a lot of people who are dating people who are very quiet, but sometimes they'll open up to them and they're a completely different person, sometimes for the better. But then you do have relationships where they open up to you and they're a complete ass, like this one is. Um, if you're honestly not happy, anyone will tell you this, if you're not happy, don't be with them. I know it might be hard because you might love them and I can't even think about breaking up with my boyfriend because I love him so much. But if I was unhappy with him, I wouldn't be with him as difficult as it is. So... Um, honestly, like, if she can't, if she's going to be quiet like that and, like, not really talk to you, not really open up to you, okay, that's one strike. And then when she does open up to you, she's a complete jerk and has really nothing nice to say. So my question is, does she really want to be with you? And I'm not trying to say that in a mean way at all, but it just doesn't seem like she just it just seems like either she's doing this so you'll break up with her or she's that's just her personality. I do know there's people out there that are just mean. <laughs> Especially being a YouTuber on YouTube. I know what it's like to deal with mean people. So um, it's kind of a difficult thing, but there really is one solution. Um, well, don't just like go up to him and be like, like, hey, I'm breaking up with you. Honestly, ask what's going on. Have you ever decided to, you know, figure out what's going on with her? Like why she says all this? Does she love you? Does she want to not be with you? Does she want to move on? Does she, you know, is this just, you got to figure out if it's really just her personality. But if you do find out that it's just her personality and you're like, oh, you know, people change. I can, you know, talk to her. She'll change people don't change. <laughs> I'm going to tell you that right now. People do not change. They'll make you think that they change to be like, oh, I won't do this anymore. You know, I won't say this. I won't act like that. My God, that is the biggest lie I've ever heard in my life. From personal experience, people do not change. Even I have tried to change for people, and I know deep inside I'm who I am. And there's a lot of people who don't like me for who I am, and there's a lot of people that do. People do not change. So try to figure out if it's her personality or not. And if it is, just realize that you cannot change her and move on. I don't know exactly how old you are, but if you're younger, move on right now. <laughs> if you're older, maybe you can kind of work it out. But if it's really something that's bothering you that much, then you have to move on because I can guarantee you're going to find someone so much better. And I know a lot of people are scared to break up with their boyfriend or girlfriend because they're like, oh, you know, if I do that, it's going to find me. It's going to take me forever to find a new person, but isn't it so much worth it that, let's say, it takes you a year or two to find a new person and you're so much happier in that relationship than your previous one you would have stayed in just to be taken and be miserable because they're, you know, bringing you down all the time. So that's kind of the gist of it. If you're unhappy in a relationship, leave it. I know how difficult it is and I've had to make these decisions before. I've had to break up with people that I love because of numerous different reasons. A couple, you know, I knew I couldn't change them. I just couldn't stand their personality anymore. And just, just a bunch of different questions. I just wasn't happy. And as much as it hurt both me and that other person, I had to do it. And now I'm much happier because I'm with somebody I absolutely love and who I care about and who I want to spend a long, long time with. So it took me, like, it took me 19 years to find who I'm with now. Well, like, technically seven years, 17 years, but, um, yeah, so the gist of this common question of the day is should I stay with somebody 
you know, who might be showing signs of not wanting to be with me or something I can't really stand, you know. Uh, should I stay with them or should I move on? Move on. I swear to you, you'll find someone so much better no matter how long it takes. And you're going to be so much happier once you do. So that's the common question of the day. Um, I did upload, upload, I did upload a couple Minecraft videos. I recorded like three episodes today. Episode 8 is really funny. I was cracking up at one part. Maybe it was just me, but I think I'm only up to episode 6 uploaded. Um, I'm going to try to upload two Minecraft videos, maybe every day, maybe every other day. I'm trying to get these guys up every day, um, but watch out for episode 7 and 8. They're really funny. So, I hope you guys have a good one. Bye!